it's really it's humbling to hear the vulnerability that we're sharing here because uh, we don't often talk publicly about imposter syndrome, but I know this is something that I've always struggled with and continue to struggle with. Um, it's very humbling, especially as a young artist, to be given the podium and the baton and told, hey, you can tell these professional musicians, many of whom have been in this orchestra longer than you've been alive, how to play better. Um, and it, it, it's, it's been something that's been difficult for me. And I think I leaned on the entrepreneurship side of things as a younger artist in, as kind of a crutch against that. Like, oh, well, if I can come up with a new idea or a cool project design or something they've never seen before, that might hide any sort of musical deficiency that they detect from you know, the podium. And um, I, it's, been a, it's been a process for me to kind of repair that feeling and think not the entrepreneurship is a strength, but every conductor needs to bring musical skills, administrative skills, leadership skills, team building skills to bear. And um, that's why I feel so comfortable 